So the, the inspiration for these donuts that we have here is a record called Donuts by a producer and musician named Jay Dilla, who um, passed away from lupus um, almost 10 years ago. And uh, I'm music directing, conducting, arranging a show where we play that album from top to bottom. So the record was very important to me and a lot of musicians of my generation that kind of changed the way that people think of making beats or the marriage between hip hop and jazz. Uh, Jay Dilla to me kind of pioneered that sound and created something new. So we have a huge band of more than 20 pieces and uh, eight string players and background vocalists and horns. So it's really just trying to recreate that album and put my own kind of spin on it and turn it into something new. So an obvious choice, the record called Donuts and we made some donuts. What we decided to do was we made uh, yuzu glazed donuts. We wanted to put a spin on that, so we paired it with a cinnamon scented affogato, traditional Italian dessert. Uh, we used a John Duya um, gelato, and then used a little Ceylon cinnamon burnt into it just to kind of give it a little bit more pop. And it's finished with some yuzu scented olive oil, and then we're gonna finish it with a double espresso shot. Just kind of look at the color of them really, make sure they're nice and even. They should be floating. Um, but I know that just from cooking these in the past, they usually take about two minutes on each side to be done on the inside, just from failure in the past. And then I can tell when they're done, just kind of like, by when I pick them up, by how heavy they are. They're not, they're a little, they're lighter after they cook. We, instead of just wanting to do the same thing that everybody else does when you think of affogato or think of donuts or what those flavors should be, we always try to think outside the box, just do a little bit, something a little bit different, put our own little spin on it, a little do sex twist. So what we chose to pair with the donuts today is we chose Bitches Brew from Dogfish Head. Um, it has three forms of imperial stout in it, which are really nice with the coffee notes, and then it's also just got a really nice smoke, vanilla, malty flavor to it that I think really balances the dish out. Proceeds from the show and this dish are going to Dilla Youth Day. So Dilla Youth Day, they do it every year in February and it's an event specifically for youth, for kids uh, in Detroit that's really geared around or focused on music and technology. So um, just giving youth uh, an opportunity to learn about drones or learn about coding or learn about the, the technological, like electronic side of music. Um, which I feel like is just so valuable. Um, you know, it's, it's crucial for, for kids to have an opportunity to be exposed to that stuff at a young age um, and just have it at their fingertips and, and play, play around and mess with toys and gadgets and see what they're into. Um, so that's Dilly Youth Day and uh, we're contributing some of the profits from the show uh, and from, from this to them to help their event.